look how pretty it is. It's a leaf season in Minnesota, anywhere up north. If you live in Florida, it probably doesn't affect you as much, but here we have to work our ass off raking it. Uh, my kids don't appreciate hard work right now, but also if you have gutters, if you have pool, you have to cover it up. And this is exactly what we're doing here at Roofing Insights. Every year we do gutter cover reviews. We'll show you what works and what doesn't work. And this year we decided to do gutter cover guides. So I reached out to all the companies on the market, all the big players. I asked my community, uh, roofers all around the country, what works? And Raindrop right here have sent us few bucks of their pro, uh, product. Brent Siemens, my co-host, highly recommended, swears by this. I actually decided to unbox it with you. I'm probably gonna install it on sections on my house. I don't know why this says cheese it, but uh, one of the reasons I decided to test this product is because Larry Gineski is behind it. Oh, wow, look at that. So they, they sent me some shirts. This is uh, looks like this is samplers and stickers. This is what you get if you install their product. Good stuff. Thank you guys for sending that. Let's see what else they have. So we're gonna review it. There's a lot of bullshit products on the market. This one here is actually one of the highest rating among roofers. So many of my friends highly recommend it. So this is uh, just a display for the show floor. One thing about gutters is you have big brands that advertises on TV, high pressure sales techniques and they will take advantage of you. You will overpay. What do we have here? All right. So it looks like we have a filter. This is interesting. So it's like a filter inside the gutters and I guess you can just clean it. Oh, look at that. This is genius. Uh, Larry Janeski, what I know about the guy, he owns over 50 patents in different areas. I actually took um, a training back in the day about installation because he owns Basement T and a lot of other companies. He's largest employer in, in Connecticut, Connecticut. And as a matter of fact, on these boxes, I've seen somewhere a return address was, let me see somewhere it says Klaus Roofing. So Klaus Roofing actually one of their companies as well. So Larry invested in Klaus Roofing and they own, my understanding, they own Raindrop. But this is kind of stuff I like to see. This will protect your downspot from overclogging. This is just like changing filter in your HVAC system in your basement. Let's see what's in this box. All right, so I guess this is the banner if you do like home show or maybe put it in your office, in your showroom. Well, I give them five stars for, for their branding. I worked with a gutter company before. We actually endorsed and review a lot of gutter products, but I have not seen so many items, you know, t-shirts, displays. The whole process was very easy. I'm like, hey guys, I want to review it. Send me some product. I only ask for product. I didn't ask to become a dealer. So this is actually the product itself. All right. I guess this the product slides in. I've seen it on displays many times. I'm actually gonna install it on the back of my house. I have. Uh, different type of covers, but I want to see how this works and this is what we're going to do today. One of the problem with a thicker mesh is it doesn't filter granules from your roof and it's actually quite a, quite a debris here because with the years all the granules going to end up in your gutters 
you can see how much I have here. One thing about raindrop, it's available in most stores where roofers buy their shingles. ABC Supply, uh, Beacon used to be allied. So roofers actually very familiar and I know a lot of contractors and director already installing it. So if you're looking for someone to install it, because this is a dangerous job. I mean, it's already cold letters. You will be surprised how many people die from doing this simple stuff. We have a company here in Minneapolis and a couple of years ago, they're a professional company. They're doing a couple of million dollars a year worth of gutter work. And actually the owner of the company was um, installing gutter covers on eight, just in front of the one story house. He was on the roof and somehow, I guess he was facing down, trying to secure the gutter, he fell down and died on the spot. Think about it, how dangerous it is. If you look at statistics, I don't want to scare you with them, but there's a lot of people dying from this. It's worth finding true professional who used to be on the ladder, who used to be on the edge of the roof to do it the right way. I don't know if I like the how big this leap is. Obviously you can cut it but when you alter an existing roof you can see that I have to go all the way here and my starter shingle is there so it's definitely not a, the best part of this design that would be brand new roof wouldn't be a problem but with the old one and on a cold day like this it's definitely challenging so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut it I just don't have enough room my nails are already starting there, so I'm gonna rip this part and shorting it. So what can I say? For unboxing video, uh, I'm pretty impressed. I would say it's much sturdier product than the rest. I mean, look, you know, you can, you can feel um, how heavy duty it is. You can definitely tell that branches and stuff not gonna break it, not gonna bend. Unlike cheaper aluminum mesh, you can see that this product was caving in and was actually, you know, denting, collecting some leaves, obviously with other uh, problems with it as well. So in a few weeks, you're gonna see I got our cover guide on our channel. We're definitely gonna include raindrop. I would say I'm pleasantly surprised. Good product, black will go almost on any roof. It's plastic, so you're not gonna have corrosion between different metals. So if you have copper, you're not supposed to do aluminum, vice versa. And plastic is plastic. Um, I've seen a lot of good reviews and a lot of, it's pretty easy to install available everywhere these days so this is my unboxing video comment below guys if you install raindrop what do you think uh, especially i'm interested to read comments from guys who've seen it on the roofs for years how does it perform overall after a couple years D does it clog with the smaller granules or does it keep everything out comment below i read all my comments and i'll consider those comments in my 2022 gutter guard review guide